<laughs> if you Benin. injure yourself, first of all, notify a demonstrator. Mm -hmm. They'll be wearing gloves to protect themselves. If you've got small objects, then you can remove them from the wound. If you've got larger ones, it may be best to leave them in there. Wash the wound. Dry it and then apply a clean bandage. At this point, you'll also need to make sure that you fill out an incident report. If you get something in your eye, like a chemical whilst gram staining, immediately move over to the eye wash area, where you should wash your eyes under running water for 15 minutes. D no, no, don't, don't pull that. That's the safety shower. That should only be used if you spill chemicals over yourself. When doing a gram stain, it's also important to wear safety goggles to prevent the need for using the eye wash. <laughs> the panel here, you push it forwards once you've got these yellow caps off and then the water will shoot up into your eyes. Some chemicals, like ammonia, have noxious fumes which can knock you out if you smell them too much. So the correct way to detect the odour of a certain chemical is to just waft the vapours towards you. <coughs> Actually, that smells pretty good. It kind of smells like tomatoes. Excuse me.